And this is my question. I always want to know why. What happened? Mikey, what he wa happened? He Break wants it down, to know Mike. why I don't like John Gruden or want him back as a coach. And literally what happened with John Gruden and the Raider Nation. Because it's a fucking mystery when the Super Bowl sabotage happened. Look, John Gruden, great coach. Came to the Raiders, underdog, had an attitude, commitment to excellence, and built the team from scratch. Then... He was born and raised in Tampa Bay, Florida. His brother coached the Tampa Bay, whatever, arena football team. Right? John Gruden had one year left on his contract. Okay? Al Davis contacted him, and the media contacted him and said, Hey, you got one year left on your contract. A, a job in Tampa Bay has opened up, John Gruden. Would you want to coach the Tampa Bay Buccaneers if the Raiders don't give you an extension? And then he said, first statement on the news media, it would be my dream to coach for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. It's always been my dream. Al Davis heard this in the media. Al Davis is a no bullshit man. Al Davis said, it's your fucking dream, excuse me. Your dream should be to continue coaching the Raiders because you built something solid. Al Davis called him up in the middle of the night and said, look, John, is it true what I heard? Is it your dream to coach the Oak, I mean the Tampa Bay Buccaneers? And John Gruden said, it's late at night, can I call you in the morning? Al Davis said, if you want a contract extension, is it your dream, your only dream to coach in Tampa? And John Gruden said, it always has been. And then Al Davis said, good night, woke up the next morning, called Tampa Bay and said, check it out make a trade. It's his dream. Let me get some first round draft picks. Let me get some money. John Gruden, get the fuck out of here. If you don't want to be a Raider, right? fuck you. <laughs> that was it. John Gruden, what? Thank you. <laughs> fuck you. So, so John Gruden left. They traded him. And right. what happened is, Bill Callahan and John Gruden right. were best friends for 15 years prior. We couldn't get rid of Callahan. He had a $9 million contract. Right. Al Davis said, let's keep the offense intact for one year You know, with Callahan. Then I'll get rid of Callahan at the end of that season because it's too much of a hit on the salary cap. So Callahan stayed with the team, missed practices, called the team out, went to the fucking Super Bowl, and then I have a video that's coming out August 9th, or you've seen it before, seen the, the Super Bowl yeah, yeah, sabotage. Yeah, yeah. I've watched that over And it times. explains a lot. And then Only one person that and it makes sense sense to fucking it ring, and that was John Gruden. It, it makes sense was not the Buccaneers that deserve Again, problems. and yeah. then John Gruden is now an entertainment industry. He knows the Raiders are the biggest entertainment media market. Doesn't matter whether they hate on us. So he goes out, I love the Raiders, I love the Raiders. Then the minute the draft hit, Johnny Mandel. Oh, Johnny! Oh, oh, me and Johnny oh, Johnny Johnny fucking that, started on that. No, I know he me and started on that. No, but why did he only talk about Johnny oh, Mandel? God, because Johnny Mandel right? is the big ticket. Right. Yeah. And that will sell him as an announcer. Okay, hold on, hold on. He will never join the Raiders as a coach. <laughs> so, know, there's an Oakland Knight with Mikey Raider. I met a guy. About like four is he or five cute? Years ago. Is no, he cute? No, he's cute. He's beautiful. He's cute. No, he is cousin. He is cousins with Ben Watson and Kenny Watson, NFL pros, all the famous. He was with the Raiders and Skip, the running backs coaches, the year of the Super Bowl. He lives in Fresno. I'm gonna hook him up with you so we can talk this because he was there. He was there. I'm gonna hook you up with him. His name is Dwayne. Dwayne Watson. Dwayne, if you're listening, I don't mean to throw you out there, dude, but he was my neighbor. He was an ex-Raider, like, not pro, but, like, whatever. But, Dwayne, I'm going to hook you up with Mikey because we're going to settle this shit. He was there. He was with Tim. He was with Jerry. And I'm going to get to the bottom. He was there on this, you know, we're going to get to the bottom of this. All the and this, this is going to be the inside. This, this is going to be inside the Raider Nation. With Mikey, I'm going to hook you up with Dwayne. And we're going to settle this shit because he was there. He was there. And I want him, I want Mikey to interview. Period. Period. Hey, Mikey, what do you think of Terrell Pryor? Oh, shit. <laughs> Good luck. I'll tell you what I think of him. Learn how to throw the ball. <laughs>
Yeah, you found Mikey, huh? Yeah. Hey, Terrell Pryor is a crybaby. Yeah. Yeah. He, he didn't know how to react to adversity. He didn't know how to react to it. Right here, yeah, he told me, I'm looking for Mikey. You have to learn He's how to for throw you. Really? He's looking for you. He's giving away cards and shit. Trust me, they have a saying with running quarterbacks. And I call them quarterbacks with skirts on them. But I go over again. You can't do that with the Raiders. You gotta yeah. throw it. I'll tell you, boy, there. Please. <laughs> yeah, probably can't throw the football. Yeah, take, take a fucking hit, right? Man. Yeah, learn how to take hey, a hit. Look. All I gotta say is much love to Raider John for recording all this shit right here. <laughs> Raider John's a man. Thank you. Raider oh, oh, John, I'm here with the big dogs. Can I, <laughs> can I join a little bit? Can I get a piece of these guys? You know, Callahan didn't change. Not in the shield. Mikey Raider, Raider yeah, John, what's up? Where we at? And why did Jerry We are we we a bonfire, not in the Seals, baby. Why did Mitch yeah, Mitch I'm glad. Yeah. And why, did, and why did Bill say it was bull crap? That's what I'm saying. Why did Rich Gannon say, oh, Jerry Rice and Tim Brown are lying. They didn't change the playbook one day before. So did Romo. Why he says it was No, but why crap. did Gannon say that? Gannon is an He's announcer. He's an announcer. He's a part of the media. Hello. And if he causes any controversy, he won't be hired. Jerry Rice said it. Jerry Rice backed up Tim Brown. Of course they're going to say that. He's a niner, too, dude. That was the niner in him saying it. Yeah, what do you expect? <laughs> Don't y'all know? Raider John is behind the camera right now. This is gonna be on his shit. Hey, Raider John, we love you, baby. What's up? Hey, hey, he's, he's a video maker on his channel. Is not in the shield. Who are you? What's up? Raider Sino. You know not in the shield? I, I seen the pelon. I knew who he was. <laughs> I know the banana over there. I love this shit. For sure. Hey, my boy right here. This is my boy right here. John right there behind the camera, though. Every time, every time I see yours, it links up to. I'm talking about my boy right here. It links up to Raider John. Raider John. Where's going? What's up? Where's going? Oh, I know. I've been here all the way. Hey, save your battery. I'm gonna go get John.